In today's video, I'm going to be ranking every single Minecraft block on which are the best to build with. Now, obviously, my opinion is probably going to be a bit different to yours, so let me know in the comments where you think I've gone wrong. And while you're there, you may as well click that little subscribe button. It's nice and pretty and we're nearly at 3 million. Oh, and at the end of the video, we're going to be building a house with my favourite blocks and my least favourite. So... Here is pretty much every block in Minecraft. However, anything that you can have like a color of like wool, terracotta, concrete, glass, I've just summed up into one block. So I've made seven tiers here. We've got very nice, best, oof, very good. Me like, yay, good stuff. Hmm, depends, yuck, yuck. And lol, are you kidding me? Who would ever want to use this trash block? And we've got to rate all these, so. Let's get to work, starting with smooth stone. Kind of indifferent when it comes to smooth stone. I quite like it, but I'm gonna put it in me like, yeah. I wouldn't really use it on a house, but it's good for terraforming. Regular granite, I'm gonna put this in, oof, very good, because I do really like that block. I have a Polish granite is gonna go in, hmm, depends. As I think it has its uses, but I'm not a huge fan. Next up, Diorite. Again, this is going in, hmm, depends. Along with polished diorite, as I think you can make it work. And decide we're gonna put in good stuff, as it's decent, but I don't know, it's just a bit boring, isn't it? And polished andesite, I'm gonna put in yuck yuck, because I just don't ever use this block. I think it's kind of ugly, to be honest. Cobbled deep slate, I'm gonna put in Oof, very good. However, normal deep slate, it doesn't have any like slabs or stairs variant. So I'm actually gonna put this in yuck yuck. I think it's an okay texture. I just much prefer the cobbled one and I would just always use that over the normal deep slate. Polished deep slate is another depends. I don't know, I just not had any use for this block yet. It's okay, but I'm just not a fan of polished blocks all around. Calcite is gonna be our first very nice best. I just really like this block. I made a pretty cool castle recently with it, and I think it looks awesome. Tough is going in me like. I love this block, however, I think it just has, you know, limited uses. And dripstone's going in good stuff because it's okay, isn't it? After building in a mesa in empires, I'm gonna put grass in very good as I miss it a lot, especially in a plains biome. Look how nice and green it is. And dirt is going in, depends, because it's good for terraforming, but I wouldn't build a house out of it. Coarse dirt, good stuff. Useful, just. Limited again, same with Podzil and Rooted Dirt. Let's just put all those three in there. Crimson Nylium and Warped Nylium. Sorry, disgusting. I hate these two blocks. I don't know why, just never use them. Don't think they look good. And Cobblestone's going in, me like, yeah. And now the controversial one. I've tweeted out the planks before and my opinion's not changed. Oakwood, very good. Spruce wood, by far the best wood. Birch, I'm sorry, is going in yuck, yuck. Not a fan. Jungle, me like. Acacia, this is tricky because I've been building with this a lot recently, but I'm gonna put it in me like. Dark Oak, definitely very good. I'm gonna put Warped and Crimson in the yellow tier. They're okay. And Bedrock, well, you just can't build with it and it's just ugly if you do, so definitely yuck. Sand is going in, depends. I just don't really use it very often. Red sand, probably the same. And gravel, I'm gonna put in yuck, I'm sorry. It's okay, it's, the texture's got better, but mm. Definitely not. Ancient debris, you gotta be mad to build out of this and it's also just hideous. And coal, we'll put in depends. It might be useful sometimes, but I'd rather just use black concrete. And all these raw blocks, I don't know what it is about the texture. I barely really use them. They change them from looking like beans, but I'm just not a fan yet. I'm gonna put them in depends because I haven't had a chance to use them yet really. Amethyst is a tricky one because I love the block. I love when you step on it, the sounds it makes and when you place it, etc. It's quite an obnoxious color, isn't it? And texture. So I'm going to put it in very good for now. Iron blocks. Hmm. I'm going to put this in yuck. I'm just not a huge fan of the iron block texture. Copper, however. Ooh, that's going in very good. And gold. Yeah, I like it. I like it. Diamond. It's a flex, but it's only very good. The proper flex, the best flex, is the never right block. Now for the other types of copper, I'm gonna put this exposed copper lower down than this one. I'm gonna put in, yeah, I like it. Whereas these next two, I'm sorry, but these are going up here. These ones are really nice. I wouldn't say they're as nice as the other ones, but they're decent. And this one, also very good. But again, this color, not so great. But the cut copper of these two, some of my favorite new blocks. I'm gonna put both those up there. I think they work so well together and they're just really, really nice. 
But now for the logs. Now this changes to the planks in my opinion. I think oak wood just by itself, not stripped by the way, we're gonna get onto that next, is a very good, it's a really cool looking block and spruce log, sorry, but that's gonna be very nice best. I love that. But birch log, I'm sorry, but unless you're making birch trees, it's hideous. That's going in the purple, that is horrible. Acacia, probably in good stuff. It's all right, it's all right. Dark oak, again, I love this texture. I think that's so nice. That's going in the best. But crimson and warped stem, I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to put these in the last tier. I'm just not a fan. And jungle wood, again, I just really don't like this. I'm gonna put that in yuck yuck. But once again, these all change when it comes to the stripped wood. Spruce, however, I'm sorry, spruce is just the best wood. Look at this, all free. Oak, again, it's good, it's good. It's probably the same as the log and the plank. Birch. I'm gonna actually put in very good as well because I've got quite fond of this recently. I built a massive palace in my thousand days world. Jungle is decent, but it's gonna be in me like, yeah. Acacia, I'm a big fan of acacia stripped wood. I'm gonna actually put this in very nice best. I think the color on this is lovely. The same with the stripped dark oak. I'm just a big fan of stripped wood. Crimson and warped once again. I feel like these two fit in the same thing. They're just very obnoxious colors. So I'm gonna put them in good stuff for now. Well, 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 have you ever seen anyone build something nice with sponge? You definitely haven't. Both sponges are trash. I'm sorry, I've said it. Regular old blocky glass. It's hard to judge, but I'm gonna put it in me like, yeah. Tinted glass. I think it's cool for making like mob farms and stuff. I think I'm gonna put it in depends because it could look cool, but ugh, I'm not a huge fan. I'm not sold. Lapis lazuli block. Yeah, it's going straight in yuck, isn't it? But what about regular old sandstone? I'm gonna put this in good stuff. I think it's okay, but in comparison to chisel sandstone, which I think definitely goes in very good, it's not as nice. And cut sandstone, I'm not a fan of cut sandstone. I'm gonna put this in yuck. I'm just not a fan of this texture, you know? And what about wool? All wool in general. Well, I think that's gonna have to go in very good. Not top tier but it's good. Now we've got some smooth blocks, starting with smooth quartz. I'm gonna put this straight into here. I think that's a really cool textured block, very useful. And smooth red sandstone, I'm actually gonna put in the best tier because I'm loving this block at the moment. Same with regular old smooth sandstone. I think these two have some of the best blocks. Smooth stone, I'm gonna put in depends. I think it's all right, it's nothing special. Bricks. Very good. We love a good brick around here. Bookshelves, one of my favorite blocks to decorate with, so I'm gonna put that in me like, yeah. I don't care what you think, moss cobblestone is going straight into the best tier. My favorite block in the game, I love it. Obsidian, however, <laughs> sorry fella, you're going straight into yuck. And purple block, I'm sorry, I've only seen a few people make purple work, and I'm just not a huge fan. I'm gonna put regular old purple block in yuck yuck, but purple pillar, I'm sorry, straight into the worst tier. Hideous. Ice again, I'm just gonna put straight into yuck, not a fan, and snow, it's just not very useful, and you'd just rather use quartz, wouldn't you? So, probably in yuck as well. Play block, I'm just, you wouldn't really ever use this just as this, would you? So I'm gonna put this into yuck, not a fan. Regular old pumpkin, Hmm. Unless you're building a pumpkin, not very good, is it? Again, yuck, same with the other two. In fact, I'm gonna put these two in the worst here. I'm not a fan. Same with Neverrack. And soul sand, lots of bad tears. Soul soil, again, terrible. However, basalt, I'm a big fan of. I'm gonna put this in me like, yeah, and polished basalt, I'm actually gonna put up here. I think this texture is one of my favorites. I built my 1000 days castle out of it. I think it looks rather awesome. And speaking of basalt, we now have smooth basalt. And again, I'm really big fan of this block. I'm gonna put it in here for now, as I just think it looks really cool. Got such a cool texture on it. It's kind of like a dark rock. Glowstone, on the other hand, even with the new updated texture, it's gonna have to be a yuck. If it was the old texture, it'd be all the way down at the bottom, but in what situation would you prefer to use this rather than the new shroom light texture? Stone bricks, classic. I think it's gonna go in the best. And same with mossy and cracked, we'll put the one below as I think these two are much nicer than the cracked. And this chiseled stone, I'm gonna have to put in yuck. It's very rare that I find a use for that and I'm not a fan. Deep slate bricks on the other hand, I'm going straight up there. I think they're very cool, these deep slate bricks. And this one as well, the tiles, also very cool. But the cracked ones, 
I'm going to put in the one below. And I'll probably put the cracked deep slate tiles in there as well. And as for the chiseled one, I'm just not liking this texture whatsoever. I just don't think it looks very good. I'm putting it in yuck. Melon as well. I'm sorry, but unless you're building a melon, it's just not a very nice texture, is it? Mycelium. I'm going to put in depends. You can make it work with stuff, but it's just not great. And never brick again. It's okay, but I'm going to put it in good stuff. And the uh, chiseled one definitely going in. Hmm, depends. Endstone, I think, is one of the ugliest textures we have in game. It looks kind of like vomit to me. So I'm going to put this straight into the lowest tier. But the bricks, I actually quite like. I'm going to put these in me like, yeah, because they work really well with sandstone. A block of emerald, I'm sorry, but this is one of the worst looking ore blocks. When I build the pyramid for beacons out of it, I hate it. So I'm going to put it straight into yuck. And same with chisel quartz. I'm just not a fan of that. But regular or block of quartz, it's good. It's good. The quartz bricks, also the same. I'm just not a fan of how these look in comparison to, you know, the regular brick pattern. But the pillar, the quartz pillars are actually probably my favorite pillars. Other than the basalt ones. I'm going to put these in the orange tier. And we've got terracotta here. And this is just terracotta in general. And I actually think I'm going to put this up here. I really love terracotta. Like the dulled out colors you get. Very nice. And hay bale, one of the best blocks for decorating farms, etc. I love how it looks different from different angles. It's kind of like a barrel. So we're going to put that in, yeah. Packed ice. Meh. Just no real opinion on this. I'm just going to put it in yuck, yuck. Stained glass block. Yeah, it's some good stuff. It's okay. I think I prefer normal glass to stained glass. Regular prismarine. Again, it's good. It's good. It's not my favorite but it's good. Kind of like a blue cobblestone, isn't it? But prismarine blocks, I'm going to put in yuck. I'm sorry. I'm not a fan of that block whatsoever. But what I am a fan of is dark prismarine. That's going straight into the top tier. And sea lanterns, again, such a nicer light source than glowstone. I'm going to put these in me like. As for red sandstone, I'm going to put this on the same tier as regular sandstone. It's nice, but it's nothing amazing. However, the chiseled red sandstone, I actually prefer this look in comparison to the regular one. I'm gonna put this in A tier. I think that's just the best by far. I've been using it a lot. I think it looks awesome. Cut red sandstone on the other hand. See you later, fella. You're going straight into yuck. Magma block. Apart from it's kind of cool that it glows, it's hideous. Straight into the worst tier. And the same with these warp blocks. I'm not a fan, to be honest. I just never like them. I'm gonna put them in the yuck tier though, because they're not the worst, but they're not the best. Red never bricks. I think I prefer these to the regular old bricks. I'm going to put these into me like, yeah. As for bone blocks, I don't know. I'm not a fan. I think they're okay, but they're just kind of useless. So I'm just going to put it in depends. Whereas concrete, concrete is a solid, very good, but not as good as terracotta in my opinion. However, the concrete powder, I love the texture of concrete powder. And I'm going to put that in the top tier. Dead coral i've just summed them all up into one because they all look kind of similar i'm gonna put that in depends because i've seen it work blue ice with all the other ice it's just a bit boring isn't it and kelp blocks i've seen people make these work but personally i'm not a huge fan of the texture like if these linked up like you know a crisscross like it was like this on the side i might like it a bit more i'm gonna put it in yuck and crying obsidian is straight into the worst here look at that thing it's absolutely hideous regular old blackstone on the other hand i'm gonna put in very good i'm a big fan of that and gilded blackstone a rare block and i think it looks awesome so i'm putting that in the top tier polished however again not a fan of polished blocks i'm gonna put that there in it depends and same for the chiseled one however the bricks i'm putting that in the a tier i think they're really cool now, a new block, the moss block. I love this block. I think it's perfect. I think it's everything Minecraft's needed. It just keeps its color in like dull biomes and it just looks awesome. So I'm putting that straight into the top tier. A furnace, I mean, it's good for decorating, but I'm going to put it in depends because it does heavily depend. And crafting table, I would never build a house out of a crafting table. I think it's quite an ugly block. It's going straight into the bottom tier. And jukeboxes, I mean, you just use a note block, wouldn't you? You wouldn't use a jukebox. So I'm going to put those in yuck. Brown mushroom, though. Brown mushroom. Quite a big fan of this block. I'm going to put this in good stuff, as it does have its uses. The red one, however, definitely depends. Unless you're building a mushroom, I don't know what you'd ever use this block for. The stem, I'm going to put in good stuff as well. It's okay. It's nothing amazing. 
a path block. I think this changed Minecraft when you could use shovels to make paths. So I'm going to put this in the top tier. I think that's a really cool block. We're getting some kind of weird blocks now. We've got the glazed terracotta in general. I think some of it can be okay, but again, it depends. It's not a great block. You wouldn't build a house out of it. You'd maybe use it for floor design sort of thing. The loom, I think, is a really cool block, and people use it to make these sort of empty bookshelves. So I'm going to put it in good stuff. Composters, me like. Yeah. And barrels, I think, completely changed Minecraft when they were added in for decoration. So we're putting those in the top tier. Smokers, depends. Blast furnaces, the same. And I reckon all of these are kind of depends. They can look cool. Smithing table, I think it's actually a really cool block because of how it looks underneath. So I'm going to put this in me like, yeah. Grindstone, I think you can make some really cool things with grindstone. It's quite a unique sort of block. So I'm going to put that in. Very good. Now, 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 campfires. I think these are brilliant. They create the smoke effect. Great for chimneys. I'm putting them in the top tier. And shroom light, so much nicer than glowstone. A really cool texture on these, I think. I'm going to put this in very good. Bee nests, I mean, they have quite a cool texture. Kind of similar to composters. So I'm going to put them just above them. And beehives, again, they're okay. They're okay. I'm going to put them in depends. Honey block. Oh, I'm not a fan. I'm sorry. I just don't think it looks very good. I'm going to put it in yuck. Lodestones, I think, are actually really pretty blocks. I love the pattern of these. However, they're quite expensive and very impractical for survival. So I'm going to put them in good stuff. And respawn anchors. It's a cool pattern, but... I'm sorry, I'm putting them in yuck. I wouldn't use them in a build. And oak leaves, I'm really big fan of these. I'm going to put these in very good. Spruce, in me like. Birch, the same probably. Jungle, I'm actually going to put with oak. I think these leaves are quite cool with their like unique texture with these little bits on them. And acacia leaves, I'm just not a fan of these. I'm going to put these a bit further down. And dark oak are basically the same as oak, aren't they? We'll put them there. But the new additions, azalea leaves. I think the regular one is definitely like an A tier, but the best one by far. These flowering leaves, I think are amazing, going straight in the top tier. Glass panes gotta go in the top tier. I think glass panes are just so much better than regular blocky glass in most situations. And iron bars, I mean, they're kind of ugly in my opinion. So I'm gonna put them in depends. Chains, I think completely changed Minecraft. So I'm gonna put those up in A tier. And slime blocks, yeah. I'm not a fan of slime blocks. They're going straight in the bottom tier. Honey, again, I just don't like them, but I'll put them in yuck. And redstone, I think this is one of the most ugly blocks in the game. Definitely worst tier. Lectons, however, I think can make really cool banisters. So they're one of my favorite blocks to play with. So I'm going to put them up here. But both pistons, you just wouldn't build with them. So I'm going to put them in the worst tier. And finally, we've got the target block. Terrible. Redstone lamp. It's how it depends. Note block. Quite like this block. I'm putting this in yellow. And lightning rod. I think these are really cool. Putting them in very good. But the coral blocks, I just think aren't very practical. So I'm going to put these all in the same tier that is there. But there you have it. Our tier list. So from the top, these are my favorite blocks by far. Very good blocks. I like these. These are pretty good. These completely depend on the situation. These are pretty disgusting. And finally, the worst things I could ever build with. I don't think I've ever built with any of these, to be honest. I'm trying to think, but I can't think of a time I've used these in a build. However, now we've made our list. We're going to build a house using the best blocks. And we're going to make a house using the worst blocks. I wonder which house is going to look better. So these are our blocks. Let's build a house. This was actually very easy to build because we could use the moss blocks for the ground. We had loads of different choices of really cool blocks, obviously, as these are my favorite blocks. And I'm really happy with how this house turned out. However, with the ugly blocks, the house turned out looking just terrible, to be honest with you. Just look at it. It's horrible. But there you have it, guys. That's it for this video. Let me know if you agree or disagree with my choices down in the comments below. And I shall see you another time. Goodbye.